Hey everyone, I hope you are having a wonderful time. Today I'm going to share my experience of using different music streamers that I have and music streaming and deck combination and which combination I like the best in my system, the sound quality features and overall usability independently of pairing with external deck. So that is much debated and requested my opinion about these streamers. So right now I have five different setup for music streaming. Everything is connected to my home Wi-Fi or Ethernet network, such as a Matrix Mini i4 doesn't have any Wi-Fi feature, so I'm using Ethernet port in the back, but Ever Solo DMP A6 I always use on Wi-Fi network as well as Wii M Pro. And another way of my streaming setup is using old MacBook Pro pairing with Audiovana. So that setup is really hard to beat, regardless of uh, what price point or what type of streamer that you are going to use. Majority of these kind of music streamer, the way that they design is very good, intelligently designed, brilliant user interface and features and everything come with it for your convenience. But when you really use it, there are some glitches, some imperfections, and some of them doesn't work really well with certain condition, depending on what type of music streaming service you use. So when I'm comparing these streamer decks, I try Tidal, mostly because Matrix Mini i4 doesn't have Amazon or Music available. When you start the app, right, Comparison of these three, we and Pro, user interface, apps, the everything that feature in the app probably is the best out of these three. I'm going to give you a quick comparison of user's interface. I'm not going to compare to my Sony Music Server app because that is a, one of the most intuitive and very simple to use app that you can get if you have the Sony HAPZ1E as music server, very simple. But the problem is they only available with Spotify streaming, so I cannot use that. Let me show you here real quick. If you go to We Am Home, the app, go in there, there is music that playing. So you can go to the music services. So if you go to manage, then there is a lot of music services that you can choose. Right now, I'm only using Tidal and Amazon Music, but you can have pretty much every high-res streaming and internet radio available. In comparison to that, if you go to this Matrix Audio Mini i4, so if you go to streaming, they are limited to Tidal and Cobas and high-res streaming and another that uh, high res streaming the Chinese service. And if you go to Ever Solo DMP A6, it takes a little while. And then you will go to streaming right here. And also this one is limited to these services. So those are the difference in app availability and native apps, features and functions and everything combined. We and Pro app is much better app in user interface and usability and features that they are offering. In sound quality is depending on what kind of deck that you're going to pair with for the Wii and Pro. If you pair with SU1, you will get around 65% sound quality of these A6 or i4. But if you pair with this kind of Luxie D40 Pro like deck, you will get even better sound quality because Luxie D40 noise like filter option totally smoke other two including Pontus 2 for me personally. The way that it can produce is dynamic, spacious and airy sound yet without any brightness or forwardness, especially if you fine tune it properly. 
like I have like minus five on the gain control, balance deck and that noise like filter feature is totally game changer. So I compare them back to back one song after another. So when I was listening to I Left My Heart in San Francisco streaming music from Tidal, all of them, back to back, and I switched the app around and cable around. And what I find it, Eva Solo DMB A6 has a sound quality of uh, a little bit of enhancement in upper range of frequencies, a little bit more forward and louder as well if you compare it to Matrix Mini i4. Mat Matrix Mini i4 is like, uh, they are following industry standards such as uh, Sony or that kind of major players giving you very good transparent sound out of that deck. It can go into any system, it will re-deliver the sound as good as the parent system is. It doesn't add or subtract anything out of your system. So that kind of transparency and accuracy are, is you are after for streaming music. Matrix Mini i4 is great option. Eva Solo DMB A6 is if you want the bigger screen as well as giving you a little bit more colorful sound. I compare all of them back to back with either my SACD ripped DSD files or my high res download files, and they are different in sounding right especially tidal have a more pronounced upper bass and slightly forward in upper mid-range to mid-range area that the way that they make this the streaming service sound comparison to that amazon music has the most accurate sound quality cobus is too bright for my taste if you already have great sounding deck or you need a streaming device you don't have to spend tons of money this Wii and Pro will get the job done, right? So that kind of sound quality and comparison that I like to make because I recommend it all of them, but if I really use them back to back, usability and everything, I prefer Wii and Pro personally. I make this video because only paying me is you by viewing my video. So that's why I want to share my sincere and honest experience with you. Price and sound quality, if you want standalone streaming, I will say Eva Solo DMB A6 is the number one spot. Matrix Mini i4 is number two, and Wii M Pro is number three for standalone sound quality. But in terms of usability, Wii M Pro is number one, and Ever Solo DMB A6 and Matrix is tied at number two because they are about the same. But I kind of want to give it to Matrix Mini i4 for having their own OS. So that is a big plus on there. And if they can improve their OS, that is going to be a great operation system that they are having right now. Keep working on it to improve it. But Ever Solo DMB A6 is using well proven Android operation system. So, Android system is kind of messy for me personally. Not really big fan of it in terms of uh, operation system wise. If you want peace of mind, just stream your music, pair with your favorite deck, I can easily recommend you Wii M Pro. Out of this three, this Personally, I like this Logic D40 Pro and Wii and Pro combination using filter zero noise filter option. It's incredible. If you are curious about R2 R combination with Wii and Pro, that will give you another dimension of a user experience. It will also brings you closer to you know, analog rig kind of sound quality, nice and engaging tone and balance with very good musicality. It may not be dynamic enough with some pairing, such as uh, when I'm using this S1EX, I'm not really big fan of R2, R deck and Wii and Pro. So when I switch over to this JBL, then that is a really great pairing so depending on what you pair with right so let's say if you have 
Bowers and Wilkins speaker. With Artu, our deck, and we and Pro will get the job done. If you have speakers such as a Kev or that kind of uh, speakers, then uh, you will want to have Delta Sigma decks in general. And another thing is, if you want one box solution, meaning you don't want to have additional music server, then a EverSolo DMP A6 is another great choice because it, you can add internal storage drive that you can put all your music in there. It can take up to four terabyte of storage, so probably it will cover most of the case. The app is really need to improve in terms of uh, browsing through internal storage because it can be uh, lacking and the features and playlist creation and everything can be a little bit time consuming. EverSolo DMP A6 is a great option if you want all-in-one solution. It does have a very good pre-stage built in there as well as this Matrix Mini i4 does have gain control and pre-control as well. We and Pro can do that. I don't recommend it. We and Pro in terms of a hi-fi sound reproduction you must use with external deck. That is my experience that I like to share with you. So that's it my friend. Thank you very much for watching and happy listening.
right, on the bass, Mr. Pretty Boy Tasty Summers. On the guitar, Autumn Ayoska Summers. Yeah. So great, on the bass, Mr. Pretty Boy Tasty Summers. On the guitar, Autumn Ayoska Summers. Mr. Pretty Boy Tasty Summers. On the guitar, Autumn Ayoska Summers. Yeah. <laughs> so great. On the bass, Mr. Pretty Boy Tasty Summers. On the guitar, Autumn Ayoska Summers. 